again a simple question uh, just more practice for framing equations quicker and better and this question I'm going to go read the question and directly go to the best equation and that's what you need to get practice on a and buy buy goods for rupees thousand and two thousand respectively trader a marks his goods up by x percent while trader b marks his goods up by 2x percent and offers a discount of x percent if both make the same non-zero profit find x i want to find a's profit a profit you buy set thousand marks it up by x percent and then there's no discount and all that this cost price is thousand this is a profit a makes now b's profit he buys at two thousand he marks it up by 2x percent then offers a discount of x percent this cost price is 2000 this is a profit he'll make these two are equal we are done and practically all we need to do is solve these two so the first one is 1000 x second one is 2000 into 1 minus 2x square plus 2x minus x plus x minus 2000 or 1000x equals 2000 minus 2000 just disappears it's 2000 into minus 2x square 4000x square plus 2000x or bring this this side 4000x square equals 1000x or 4x square equals x 4x square minus x equals 0 x into 4x minus 1 equals 0 x can be 0 or x can be 1 by 4 it cannot be 0 because they make the same non-zero profit so x has to be 1 by 4 1 by 4 is 25 percent get done right this skill of writing x percent is just x and what i'm treating x as is something like 0 0.3 0 0.2 0 0.5 so if x were 50, x percent were 50 percent then this x would be 0 0.5 this is important because this, this reduces the complication of writing x by 100, y by 100, k by 100 all the time. I am treating x as a decimal. 25% is 0.25 or 1 fourth. That is how this equation is framed. That idea of framing an equation with a variable instead of continuously dealing with x by 100s and y by 100s, dealing with just x's and y's can simplify life enormously. But the most important thing, the moment you read the question, you should be writing down these two equations straight away without really getting out of bed. And so that practice is extremely important to knock off these kind of questions. Right? Keep it in mind.